Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to the Calm Before the Storm Mod in Hearts of Iron Forum. I'm your host, Mr. Yosef Lover, or Yosef Bessarianois. Yeah, that guy's lover. But right now, we're doing a new superpower. We started the Great Patriotic Wars in an unknown backward state when it merges a modern superpower. All will tremble to might and collectivize conquer territories. Our new territories are not yet rebelled on the Soviet model. Our government must begin collecting or collectivizing agriculture once more. Ha oh, yeah. An anti intellectualism campaign. The intellectuals are a danger to the Soviet order. The writers, composers, and film directors are all conspiring to bring down our Soviet social state. Remove coerced scientists. But we love coerced scientists, but oh well. As you can tell, um, I've already gone ahead and liberated quite a few things here, quite a few people, you know, ish, and stuff like that. Um, here, here it is. So basically, we have an iron curtain, sort of like. They have the allies that are all around here. They're nice and light blue. I love this color. I love blue so much. But obviously, we have full Germany. Um, we don't have Poland. Even, even though. I can build in the Polish state. I don't understand that. But they're in the allies. So, yeah. Um, I can build in Yugoslavia, too. And Greece. And they're also in the allies. So, that's very weird and awkward. But whatever. Uh, obviously, this mod is not done. Apparently, they're still working on it, which is fine. But yes. I sh it's, not, it's not a stroke, obviously. I, I always like releasing. Austria with Germany under Telman. Actually, deal with the Great Depression. Review military of the German army. Okay, so yeah. Uh, it's not really a unique focus tree, but this slightly is because it reds, but whatever. So yeah, Germany has Austria. They basically have pre World War II Germany. Of course, I don't know this. Also, I, Poland did have Grodno. I'm like, this looks disgusting. Just take it. Just take it for now. Uh, so yeah, we have under Telman over here. Oh, night vision is very nice. We also have... Who's in Poland? Yes, I just saw Musiki? Musiki? Huh. We also have the Czechoslovak Union, because if you follow my channel at all, you know that I do not like it when you have a lot of small little sub-states, which, I mean, sometimes they're necessary, but I don't like that just because it reduces lag in the game, which I don't like, but that's all right. Um, let's see. We have... Who are you again? Uh, that flag could be better. Uh, Clement Gottwald. We have Hungary here under... Is that historical? Horthy, do we really want you here? Traditional society... Hmm, state capital coordination. Paramilitary youth. I got secret police. And of course, we have... Handsome Peter II there. Wow. And we also have Romania here. Oh, I like that hat. Georg, uh, Georgiu Dej. And we have the good old Dimitri... Georgi Dimitriov. Dimitrov. And Bulgaria. And we have these guys in the Allies over here. In Italy, they're led by no, no face king, soldier king, Vittorio Emmanuel III. Okay, uh, that doesn't make any sense to me, but whatever. Actually, yeah, you're kind of stuck. You're the, this focus tree is not very. Hmm. Then again, I mean, this is. I don't know. This looks like maybe the beginning one. I'm not really sure. I'm not sure how developed Italy is at the time of this recording, but it is what it is. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much Europe. Uh, we also have not Sweden, but Norway too. Uh, under Hakon the seventh, so I'm not sure how Leninist they really are. I don't think they are, but the big deal. If we're to build up a country who cannot rely on the proletariat, they're simply incapable of doing so. It's a white collar professional, engineers, bureaucrats, and economists who will be our base of support. We'll give them a good life, and they all pull the nation. The fourth five year oh the fourth year five year plan. Uh, we'll do that one probably last. And re restrict the population. Due to the chaos of war, we loosen the people's chains a little bit. It's time to forge them and return to normalcy. Uh promotes Who's this? Georgi Zakharov. We could demobilize. The people have worked hard enough. It's time to give them a rest. We remove cold sacrifice and go down to partial mobilization, which is not cool. So let's not do that. Uh, we're probably against the Japanese. Are the Japanese still fighting? Oh, they are. Are you fighting America? Yeah, you're fighting the Allies. Oh, and they're out of manpower. Good. Very good. And they have 19 divisions left. Yeah, Japan in Call of the Storm mod, they don't seem very strong at all. Do they? They should have unique focus tree by now, right? Right? National unity government? Yeah, they do, sort of. Yeah, they definitely do. An aggressive economic policy. Moderate fiscal policy. Conservative measures. Huh. Balance between extreme self-reliance. Alright, cool, whatever. The big deal, though. Nice. Uh, anything else here? Uh, the Allies are doing pretty well over here. Chinese United Front, obviously. Oh, and also, uh, I guess Italy owns this now. That's core, but we own the, so basically this part of Libya. And... If, like I said, if you follow my channel, you know I don't like having a lot of little puppet states. So I gave Ethiopia all of Somalia. Because no one gives a crap about Somalia. Like, let's be real here. No one cares about Somalia. Even though they have a unique focus tree. That's really cool. The wall wall crisis? That's kind of cool. It's war crisis averted, huh? The big deal. And we restrict the population, of course. Um, ooh. Who is this? Lysenko. 
You sound a little familiar. I wonder where you're from. But let's do the dawn of China. Our literature and films must display the best engineers, the smartest scientists, and purest ideolo ideologues. Where if an ideology is strong enough, it can overcome any scientific law. <laughs> We're going a little crazy there, aren't we? Um, but yeah, overall, I, I love a strong Germany. That's why we love them. Yeah, this is not a very good Iron Curtain. Oh, yeah, also, we have, also have Albania here, too. And uh, Andra Hoxha. Hoxha. I don't know how to say that. How do you say that? How do you say his last name? Do you know? Like, is it Hoxha? 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 Islands and the Allies. What's America up to? Should be FDR, right? Mr. Handsome? Yeah, there it is. I guess he won again. Oh, yeah, he's going to die soon, isn't he? But I've played as the United States before. But yeah, I, another comment was, uh, play as China. I would like to, but I want to wait until they get a unique focus tree, because they don't really have a unique focus tree. That one is just kind of the generic one, so I do want to wait. They look very fun to play as. It would be very difficult, but maybe, maybe not very difficult, but just it would be fun to play as sometime. Um, yeah. So, eventually, eventually. And someone wants to play flying just Poland. We'll see. Actually, Poland, do you have a, what's your focus tree like? If you were a military, huh? Polish army. Yeah, looks maybe kind of generic as well. Our place in Europe. What if everything is falling or failing? Yeah, that's definitely generic. So probably not them yet. Eventually, at the time of recording, the last time th th this mod had an update was quite a t while ago, so... We'll see. We'll see. So, um, let's see. I didn't want to take these guys up, but we didn't have no option here to do so, so... There you go. Cool. So I think from here on out, there's nothing. I was waiting for like a Potsdam conference, but it's only 1944, and it's not very historical at this point anymore. So let's just go through all the uh, focuses together. So, Council Commands, FA. I'll do that one. De heroization. The Soviet hero of old was a zealous worker, working only for the collective and sacrificing himself for the revolution. But this is not how people live and act. Why show the people a caricature of themselves when we can depict life realistically? New Aparachiki. Post-war bureaucracy does not need to be the most ideologically pure, but they need to be capable. Ah, Lysenkov, China. Thorofim Lysenko, a great man, produces the only the correct theories. Acquired characteristics can obviously be inherited, as genetics is a product of the fascist, fly-loving biologists. And any other science is hogwash. The proletarianization. The proletarians are a good bunch, but they possess the correct political opinions, we think, yet so lack skill. We must encourage intellect, intellect work, not manual labor. Embourgeoisement. Embourgeoisement. The bourgeoisie live value, luxury, and comfort. Is this not how we want people to live? We must teach them that a comfortable life is their goal. Oh, huh. return to normalcy. On the basis of our reconfiguration of society is fundamentally complete. We now simply need to wait, and the people will fall in line all on their own. Now, we're not going to do foreign outreach. It would make more sense to appease the West for now as our position is being consolidated and we're repairing. No, the East Hegemon. The USSR shall be the hegemon of the entire East. Our position stands strong, yet as fresh as means it's somewhat precautious. Our order must be safeguarded. Antagonize America. America is a nation of immense industrial capabilities. It's only natural that they will be our main enemy going forwards. We must break our pact with them and demand that our people hate everything America stands for and offend the Empire. As we, having satellites, are obviously an imperialist power, we must direct the people's attention at another one of our true enemies, the United Kingdom. We can do the Turkish Straits issue. Uh, Turkey's control of the Black Sea shipping is unacceptable. How are we meant to exert our power if we cannot get our navy back out of the Black Sea? Demand greater Georgia. Trebizond and Ezram are land stolen from Georgia and Armenia during the Ottoman dream. As we control Georgia and Armenia proper, we can now to make control of what is rightfully our territory. Well, we already own them, so we must do this one. Consolidate control over satellites. Our satellite nations need political purges and some more Soviet liaisons to ensure that our puppet leaders do not get ambitious or ambitions of their own. The fourth five-year plan. The fourth five-year plan will focus on restoring the country to its previous industrial capabilities and continue development to match the West. Our new stock of gulag inmates will be useful to build up our new industries. Fix the country. While we are in a terrible state, we can spend resources on rebuilding destroyed factories and infrastructure. Match the West. The Western capitalists will soon become our main enemy, but if we were to match them industrially, we would be able to better influence the world, expand civil aviation. Why is our motherland, and to better connect it, we shall build new airports. Introduce the IL-2, or 12, I mean. Now that we have airports, we need planes to fly them. The IL-12 is a modern plane that can make can, we can make quickly and cheaply. Let's still supplement our fleet of LI-2 planes. Connect the country. New and modern railways are necessary to ensure that our infrastructure needs uh, are satisfied. Uh, middle class luxuries. If we were to promise luxuries to the middle class, we must supply, supply to them. However, it's likely that few people will actually get the benefits we promised and modern rail cars. If we support the modern Soviet passenger, we must create new and modern rail cars for them. 
expand pig iron mining. We're afraid to build new factories. We'll need more iron to build out of. We'll have to produce over 500 or 50 million tons of pig iron by 1950, fuel for factories. We must expand our oil mining operations if we're to build a modern military. Let's oil be made into fuel to be made into socialism. Expand the army. Now that our infrastructure and resource operations are modernized, we can expand our arsenal and jet engine improvements or innovations. The age of the propeller is over and the era of the jet propulsion is beginning. As the jet engine takes planes faster and faster, we will get to the communist future. Cool. But I think that's pretty much it for us here. Um, we might have the Potsdam Conference eventually, but whatever. Eventually, uh, I... Oh, for, 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 plan, there you go. Whatever. Um, I do want to do an AS Circle run to see what would happen. Oh, I guess... America never gave Sicily and Corsica back. But whatever. But hey, I guess that's going to be a little shorter than normal. Actually, quite a bit shorter than for most of my videos. But if you enjoyed it, regardless, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. Let me know how you thought this campaign in the comments below. And recommend other nations for me to try out in the column before the store marred for Hearts of Iron 4. Thank you very much for watching. Have a tremendous, tremendous, tremendous rest of your day.